subtraction with borrowing. So let's go ahead and subtract these two numbers. I'm going to start off by subtracting 8 from 3. And unfortunately, we can't do that since 8 is larger than 3. So I'm going to borrow from the next digit, which is 0. And again, 0, we can't borrow from that. So I'm going to have to borrow from the next number, 3. I'm going to borrow 1 from 3, which makes it a 2. And my 0 will become a 10. So now let's try this problem again. I can't subtract 8 from 3, so I'm going to borrow from the next digit. Now it is a 10, so I can borrow. My 10 will become a 9, since I'm going to borrow 1. And my 3 will become a 13. 13 subtract 8 is 5. 9 subtract 3 is 6. 2 subtract 3, I can't do this. Therefore, I must borrow from the next digit over, which is 7. So I'm, I'm going to borrow 1 from 7. I'm going to make my 7 to 6. And my 2 into a 12. 12 subtract 3 is 9. And bring down to 6. So my resulting answer will be 6,965. And this completes my problem.